So I don't know if I'm tripping, but I just bought this. I just bought this strawberry neutral grain bar, as you can see. And it looks like that inside. Is it supposed to look like that? And why is it so dry? My bad. What's up, YouTube? I'm back with another video. Shout out to the Beastie fan for tapping in. Let's get to this video, man. Live and direct. We live at 5, even though it's 336. It's so dry and it doesn't taste like strawberry. I think I got a mystery neutral grain bar. Sorry for talking with my mouth full. My bad. Gotta wash it down with the bang. That strawberry, man, this shit's so good. It's so smooth. And this is, whoa. And the aftertaste is like a strawberry uh, uh, starburst. This is not a paid promotion though. Not a paid promotion of, of Bang. But hey, if any Bang sponsors decide to watch this video and you wanna sponsor me, let me know. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, Beastie fam, but what we doing today is I'm about to break down the day into like three videos if I can. So you will see this outfit in a couple of videos. You know what I'm saying matches a blue seat belt. Oh hey YouTube, living with Corey Mo. I've been wearing my own merch. Got got some stuff made. Masks, shorts, shirts. I need to do some hats. Uh, but shout out to Nike for you know the match. It's cool. And I got the blue 11s on the feet. I mean whoa 11s. That is disrespectful. Hey, but if they had some all royal blue 11s, I need them. Oh, uh, I actually got the royal blue fives on my feet. Sorry. I'll show y'all the drip here in a minute. Actually about to go link up with uh, Life of Sliz right now. Make sure I go over to his channel and uh, subscribe. Drop down in his comments of his latest video and tell him Corey Mo sent you. You know what I'm talking about? Um, it's a gloomy day out here. It's humid. It's like 84 degrees. It was raining earlier, a little bit off and on in Dallas. Um, it's been, the weather been shitty, but no excuses. So today I'm, I'm coming with three videos. Right now I'm actually gonna go meet, link up with Sliz. We're gonna go to the dealership and talk to them about uh some stuff which i'll cover more of that once i get there i'm not gonna bore y'all don't skip through the video please watch the whole video i need my watch hours to go up um you know what i'm saying just let it play just just let it if you rock with me just let it play you know what i'm saying i don't got no ads in my in my videos because i'm not monetized yet but even when i get ads in my videos y'all really got really need y'all let it play you know what i'm saying support is free don't forget that Support everybody around you. Support those who support you. Support those who are working their butts off. You know what I'm saying? Support is free. And the grind pays off. So I'm back on it. Um, once I get to the dealership, or once I link up with Sliz, I'll turn the camera back on. All right, y'all. So this is the vibe. We up here at Huffing, Huff, the Huffings. Huffings. Huffines. Chrysler Dodge G Ram. Uh, they got some GTs in the front. Wait a minute. Why? And they got something pulling in right now. But, uh. Yeah, so we came up here real quick to check something out. What we doing? I don't know if y'all been paying attention to the car market, but the car market is like crazy right now. Um, they're giving people a lot of money for used cars. If you sell your car, or use your car as a trade-in. So, yeah, that's what we coming to see. See what they talking about. How much, y'all drop down in the comments right now before you watch any more of this video. Drop down in the comments. Tell me how much you think they gonna offer me for my car. 2019 Dodge Charger RT. Hey, Cause right now the value for my car is more than what I owe. Yeah. So I'll be looking to try to, like I said, I looked up a, uh, I think it was a brand new wide body RT, and I did it. I built, I built it on the uh, Dodge website. What oh. that's basically ordered. So, in the sense of that, I would probably want to do that, but I'm probably gonna wait like another couple weeks. It's not gonna be too long, 
to where he said the value of the used car gonna go down. It won't be so down. What, I, what I would tell you, right, in your situation is, hey, you know, hey, it's gonna be a couple of weeks. You know, you're getting good ass money for yours, right? Yeah. Because depending when you bought it, I mean, you're all probably in equitable positions depending on if you rolled in negative equity or not, stuff like that. But almost all three of y'all are probably in a solid position. But, now here's where, here's where it gets good, it's right? Good. So if you order one, right? Let's say it takes 10 weeks, right? Two months. Your car's ready. Let's say it's faster than that. Eight weeks, right? Thought you say, hey, man, I'm feeling, I'm feeling like now is, is a good time. You are saying the market's not going to change, everything like that. I mean, so, that's what I would do. Right? You said it's a uh, 500 deposit, on right? Yes, sir. Most likely be back like a month or so. So I think I'm actually thinking about doing it. If I can get a brand new car and my note's the same as what I'm paying now, I'm getting a brand new car. Maybe not cheaper, right? Yeah. Right. There you go, And for a brand new car. Because y'all still, still doing a 0% APR if they uh, go through Cry uh, Chrysler Capital? I'm not too sure about that. Okay. Because I know it has the option when you do the building price. Yeah, it has the option on there. I'm just, I'm, I don't know. It's on my head and I don't want to lie to you. Okay. I had a question. Like, so if it will be brand new and it comes with the 50,000 uh, miles, right? Not financing the, uh, the warranty. So. Yeah. Yeah, everybody's in, everybody's in different boats. Everybody's in different situations, you know. So, you know, whichever situation that fits your needs, that's what I would try to get you in. Mm -hmm. Like, if you're like, hey, man, I need a wide body RT. I need this for my trade. I try to work for my people, you know. Where y'all from? I'm, I'm, I'm new to the, the DFW crew. I'm, I'm from Houston. So. Oh, okay. Uh, Pretty sure you see plenty of yeah. action going on with the cars out there, too. Oh, yeah, man. Texas Tupac. Yeah, they do all types yeah. of stuff. I was going to say you, you picked the right dealership to work for because Dodge is selling like crazy out here. Oh, man. I tell you what, this company is something special, too. Uh, uh, they're really good company. They don't mess around with their customers. They're really straightforward. Y'all do the YouTube, uh, YouTube? -ing? Yes, sir. Cool. Recording right now. I was actually gonna ask you, do you mind being on, on camera? All right. I didn't want to be sitting here like recording you. And hey, man, uh, go ahead. Shout out your your name and everything, so they can come holler at you. My name's Anthony, and uh, I work at Huffines Dodge. What's the address here? Uh, 10, uh, 1024 uh, South Stemmons Freeway, Louisville, Texas. Yeah, so y'all heard him, man. If y'all need a Charger, Challenger, truck, Durango, it don't matter what you need. Come come holler at him. Good guy right here. No, I man, that's really not what it is. Like, Let's see, I'm not going to tell y'all what I'm going to order. I got to wait on it. It's a mixture, man. It's like the perfect storm, right? But, uh, are you familiar with like the housing market right now? So I mean you got like in addition to you got shortages in the homes, right? You got banks willing to give people money at a low rate. I mean you got low demand. So that's three really important things in any economical situation, right? Cars, boats, homes, bourbon, watches, whatever you're into, you know. And that's really what it is right now is I mean people don't have the inventory. People are getting back out. They want to spend tons of money. Uncle Joe's giving out checks left and right, you know. Uh, I mean, that's that's what it is, you know. And like homes, that's a crazy thing. I bought my home in 2019. I paid 240000 for it. I had someone come up to my house saying, hey, I'll give you 380 for your house right now. What? I'm like, this house, you're giving me 380 I would have had the keys. Here you go. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, dude, I'll go to an apartment. You know what I'm saying? But... It's just crazy, you know. You got people that are out here saying, "Hey, I'll buy this car right now," but you got people that are just quicker, you know. That's when you get into situations like you have no cars, and then the demand, right? So people will start going to used cars. But now even used cars, I would not buy a used car right now. So no. People lose so much money. 40, 50, 60 grand for a used car right now. Yeah. It's crazy. But um. I mean, y'all gonna be the first ones to do it, so. I keep it being, I'm not doing the deposit right now, so I'm gonna right. when I got ready for the deposit, so. I feel that, I can give you my uh, my number if you just wanna. Yeah, that's good. Uh, you didn't text to me. So, what is it? It's 
uh, 281. 1029. Yeah, see, I was trying to do, I was trying to order mine closer to my birthday because I was going to do a take and delivery of, you know, around my birthday, um, which is November, but while the market is how it is right now, I might end up doing it sooner. So, I just put Marcus Dodge out. Yeah, because one of the options I had, I had a friend that wanted to take over on my car. Um, and I actually did take over some negative equity. So, I think like right now I owe 42 on my car. Yeah. And it's a 19. Um, so, I mean, depending on how much I could get for it as a trade in. I would probably go off that just to see what I need to do and to prepare. You know, I would tell you this, man. I mean, you know, you got, you're saying, hey, man, I came in with negative equity. Dude, I'll, let me answer you with the fact. Do you know majority of Americans have negative equity in their oh, cars? Oh, yeah. I mean, cars lose value, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, uh, I have negative equity in my car. <laughs> yeah. And I work at a car dealership. <laughs> so, uh, you know. Yeah, that's most definitely why I'm thinking about it now, too, because I could get rid of the negative equity that way and get something brand new. That way I could basically start fresh and just owe the actual MSRP on the car. So y'all do, like, uh, any racing or anything like that? Not really. Or, like, what's y'all's channels kind of geared to? It's like, 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 cars, guns. You like guns? Guns. Man, what's up, <laughs> I picked up yeah. a, uh, a ticket uh, tick attack A1 T3X. Uh, I put an Apple scope on it. I got a uh, two Scorpions. That's, that's what I found on Jason Scorpions. the price tag on that club, but they throw them bitches to the roof. Yeah. That's another part. The guns are crazy right now. Oh, but yeah. The real problem is the ammo. Yep. The ammo is expensive and, and kind of kind of dry. Yeah. It's best best place to get it right now is gun shows. Oh really? I've never been to a gun show. I recently just got put on game guns though. Man. Yeah. Cars and guns and shoes. Yeah. Hey, hey, matter of fact, matter of fact, don't let them fool you because both of these guys are famous. I'm not, he's famous, not me. Yeah, hey, hey, you ever heard the song Stanky Leg? I ain't even said shit. I ain't even say shit. That's him, that ain't me. Bro, it's, it's, I made the beat. The beginning says Mark D. Nasty production. I don't know. You was in the music video. Hey, I was on the music video. That's me. Nah, he was on the verse. Nah, he was trying to put people on. He was trying to put people on the spot. Nah, he was on the verse. Hey, These guys are famous. And they drippy. That's that, uh, that song, you know, it's like, uh, it's, you've been what? Where? With who? Are you talking about answering all the questions? <laughs> yeah. That's <laughs> funny. You know, he was on the YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. So, yeah, we're just trying to figure out which one we're going to get next. They ain't big guys playing on some dude. Just be like, uh, what's his name? Uh, he's a bigger fella. He's like, uh, he had all the, the TTV. Uh, TTV. Uh, his name's like something in a Hellcat. Ami. Uh, Ami. Oh, there you go. Yeah, okay, yeah. Get yourself one of those, man. Hey. Hey. Them motherfucking prices took off my blood. I'm not about to be paying $1,000 for a milk. Not unless it's a McLaren or a Lambo. <laughs> I'm not doing no hard. I'll pay it then. I want a Hellcat, but I don't want to spend no more than at least eight. Yeah, and if you want to go to like C8. Well, shit, now's the time. If, bro, if you order a brand new Hellcat and you don't get it like fully loaded, you just get like a sunroof and the color you want, I mean, you can get one for like 70000 And depending on how much you put down, you can get it for like 700 a month. Uh, bro, I'm, thinking, I'm thinking of a different car at that point. What? It depends. Cause he, I, he goes to the GTR. 
I'm bro, oh, I'm yeah. going all over the place. Them supers was hard. One passed by us earlier. Yeah. I'm not gonna cold. cap, man. Them supers, I looked at them, but dude, 50, 50 racks. That's a, uh, I mean, that's a lot of money. I ain't gonna. Yeah, I really want an SRT Jeep or a Trackhawk. They have a good value. No, that's where I'm sitting at. Yeah, but you do that brand new Trackhawk. You spending over a hundred. Yeah, but, but shit, right now, if you go get the SRT, you might as well get the Hellcat. Yeah. The SRT Jeep, what, going for 60 grand? Yep. How many subscribers y'all got? really just hard. Like, he got more than everybody. He got more than everybody. He, he everybody, everybody shooting up. He catching up to me. He, he like 600. I got like 600. Yeah. yeah. Hey, you got that 601. <laughs> Jack. Uh, we are making sure to go up on there. Hey, man. Trying to make it a around here. Keep it moving. Oh, yeah. Got it. The grind. Partnership. The grind don't stop. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Partnership, let us test drive some cars yeah. around here. Hey, and plus the merch. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I got you on here. Uh, Shay, y'all, hey, matter of fact, y'all heard him say his number. You can hit him up if you're looking for a certain car. Make sure you call him or text him. No and prank I, calls. Yeah, no, no, no prank, prank calls. calls. <laughs> and, and don't call and waste his time if your money ain't right. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, most definitely. Y'all have no Hellcat Durangos up here at TRXs, do y'all? Nah. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, should even uh, hit us up if y'all got one coming. That way we could come do like a review or something. And I mean, we'll shout you out every video. Make sure you know. And on Instagram, I got like 2,500 followers on Instagram, so I'll shout you out on there too. For sure. Yeah. You, I mean, you got my number, so when it gets to that time, just let me know. I'll it's all about straight. networking. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'll shoot y'all straight. I don't, I don't mess around. Uh, how you doing? What you about to Um, what time is it? Y'all see that? Like I was telling y'all, man, if y'all are interested right now in trading your car in and getting a new car right now is the time to do it. Right now, like go do that before they start changing. I don't see the market changing anytime soon, but just in case y'all heard the man, so um we all three are definitely getting new cars ASAP. Um, I was trying to do mine for my birthday, closer to my birthday, but um, it might end up being sooner than that. Um, I need to talk to my homeboy, uh, Jeff. Jeff hit me up. Um, yeah, but uh, I'm gonna hit up Jeff and see. Uh, I mean, if it falls through and he don't end up wanting to do what we talked about, then um, Y'all might be y'all might have a chance to come get the beastie uh, RT. You know what I'm saying? Y'all might have a chance to rock the blue seat belts. But we'll see. Um I'll keep y'all updated. So basically, y'all I, I wanted to record and let y'all see everything we were talking about. That way y'all have an idea of what this video was about and what to expect. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and post notification bell. That way, when I do take delivery of a new car, you'll be notified. Or if I drop any new videos, period, you'll be, you'll be notified. So shout out to the Beastie fam. Thank you all for the love and support. And you know what I'm saying? We go, we going up. So uh, new car coming soon. I still don't want to let y'all know what I'm going to get until I get it. You know what I'm saying? Just to keep the suspense there and keep y'all in tune. Just in case y'all are out of tune. So stay in tune. Stay tuned. Uh, you know, stay buckled up. We going on a ride. So, yeah, man, I appreciate the love and support, man. To the next one.